Hello everyone! Stunt Runner release on Rec Room today, and it's a new activity. It is pretty cool, but we have some new stuff in custom rooms, and I wanted to share with you how to use them and what they are. So, without further ado, let's begin. So the first thing we have, first of all, are new textures. So if you go on your makeup pen, in your palette, so makeup pen, which is located in your backpack, tools, makeup pen, you can also favorite it so you can grab it from your back, just like this. Go on open palette by looking at it, and then materials. And now we have some new materials, such as rubber floor, metal floor, tread, crash pad, painted wood, grip tape, galvanized metal, and particle board. And this one over here is the rubber floor that I'm using. I'm using crash pad for these walls, uh, tape grid for this red wall, and crash pad as well here, and metal thread over here by the black, um, the black uh, floor. There's also some new, um, some new props obviously, um, such as the light chevron, or chevrons, I, I don't remember which one it is. Uh, those can be recolored, which is really awesome, the way you can recolor them. Uh, I made mine black, so it's black, and when it lights up, it's purple. So it lights up to their neon colors. Pretty sick. Um, so in this, I'll be showing you how to use wall running uh, climbing and sliding in your custom rooms. Now sliding for some reason is a bit janky. I tried sliding down the slopes and it didn't seem to actually like keep my velocity so I'm not sure what's up with this. So yeah, um, let's show you guys how. So the first thing you want to do if you want to enable wall running, go on this room on your watch. Go to rolls Select the role you want to edit, go to Walk VR, and there is an option Can Wall Run. So click Override and slide it to Yes. There's also a Can there is there is also a, a Can Get Pushed option and a Can Ram. So select these. And then if you enable wall running, it should look like this. Now for the climbable walls, this is a bit different, a bit trickier, but as you can see, I am attaching myself to a wall and I can climb it. And I made this with the makeup end, so I think this applies to any makeup end shapes, and I think it even applies to props. So, and like I said, sliding, a bit janky, stops me mid-slide, not sure why. Um, let's show you guys how you can make your own climbable surfaces. So you'll create a makeup and shape. So I'm gonna create mine with um, middle thread. Uh, let's say I'm gonna make a cube. So just like this, I'm gonna be manipulating it a little bit to make it bigger. Uh, I'm also I'm actually gonna put it in front of here so that way I can show off while staying on the ground level. Click done. Go on configure on this object. First of all, maybe it's going to be grabbable by default. The is grabbable option might be selected. If that is the case, make sure it is unselected. Once it's unselected, there is an is climbable, climbable option. Select it. And then, voila. We got ourselves a climbable maker pen object. So I can climb on the other side, just like this. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, leave a comment down below on what tutorial I should make next. And I hope you guys have fun and create awesome rooms using these tools. I'll see you on the next time. See you, Rec Room.